be kind to people. You don't know what people are going through. So left the eye doctor. They ended up telling me that I have. Good morning, everybody. It is 8.39. I am currently doing lifts. Um, I didn't go to work today because I had to get my sister from the airport. So I just decided to do the lift. I just wanted to go ahead and start a vlog. I know I haven't been posting um, consistently. So everything is content, like everybody says. So this is how we start this vlog. I'm not sure how it's gonna go. I do wanna go to um, Walmart and get a few things. So I will see y'all in a minute. <laughs> much much later hello editor key here so the clip that i'm about to show i just wanted to explain to you all a little bit um i ended up going to my co-workers new year's party um it was pretty fun and the interesting thing is she is from lao which is outside of thailand so it was really nice to be able to you know see how another culture you know parties and has a good time they had a bunch of different food um they had drinks and like i didn't feel out of place or anything i mean of course it was you know awkward okay because it was me and my other co-worker who we were the only two black people but like it's still i still felt welcomed you know everybody gave us hugs and everything so um that's what y'all saw i didn't get a lot of footage Simply because you want to enjoy the moment and not try to, you know, record every single little thing. And then I didn't know how her whole family would have felt about that. Um, so, but yeah, it was a lot of fun. So that's what this is that y'all are about to see now. The next day. When I say I hate having dry skin, I have been trying. My face is so edgy because I forgot to put on lotion before I left the house. And I thought I had lotion in my purse, so I have an eye appointment. Um, this is going to be my first exam and I don't know how long. Honestly, y'all, I have not realized how important it is to get your eyes checked. Because I, and this is embarrassing, but I used to be like, well... My vision has always been great. It'll be fine. But clearly, the older you get, your vision is not going to stay the same. You know what I mean? So, anyway, I'm coming here to get my eyes checked because y'all know I ran up on that curb. If you have not watched my last video about me running up on that curb, please go back and watch it and come back to this. I hurry up and wrap this up. But I'm really not having the best day. Um, I'm actually feeling much better since I done ate um, because before this, honey, I just was not having a good day. But I feel like eating has kind of helped my mood a little bit. It's just been a lot going on in my life in every aspect, financially, emotionally, just mentally, everything has been a lot going on. And I really did not want to bring that into the new year, but I really don't feel like I will truly be able to get better until my circumstances and my environment changes. If you are not in a good environment, I don't feel like you're gonna be able to like evolve and just get better as a person in general if that makes sense so um i'm gonna try to do what i can to with what i have um i need to start back journaling because i it's just a lot i might make that a whole nother video but i wanted to address something really quick as well this video is all over the place but 
I made a short yesterday about how basically I went to uh, McDonald's and the one of the people at the window, I felt like she was kind of rude. So I was getting, give it, she gave me my change and I said, thank you. And she just didn't say anything. She just closed the window. So in my eyes, you're being rude. So somebody commented, and this is my first, I guess, trolling, bullying experience, whatever. Well, really my second one. And the person was like, um, they probably, I don't remember exactly what they said, but they basically was like, she probably didn't hear you. Um, for you to think that's rude, you just think the world revolves around you or something along those lines. And social media, everybody clearly has their own opinion. But, and that's fine. If you don't think that the person should have said you're welcome, okay, that's your opinion. But to sit on here and say the world doesn't revolve around you and blah, blah, blah. Huh? All it took was for her to say you're welcome. That's not me trying to be uppity or nothing. And I addressed in the video, I said, I'm not the one that made you work here. The short is still up, so um, you should be able to go to my page and see it. But... There is a big issue when it comes to um, fast food customer service. Now, customer service, because I have did all of them. That's the thing. I've done all of these things. And I worked fast food when I was in high school. I did it for a freaking year. I know how it is to be a fast food worker. I know exactly how it is. And people are very rude. The customers can be very rude. However, we all have bad days, but don't use that as a reason to be rude to everybody that you come in, count, in contact with. That's all I was saying about that girl, because to not say anything at all after somebody says thank you. And honestly, people don't even say thank you when you do things. So to hear, when I used to hear people tell me thank you, I used to say you're welcome because, okay, I appreciate you just for saying thank you because I've had rude people all day. So I'm just saying it wouldn't have killed her to just say you're welcome. And that's not the first time I've experienced that. Like when it comes to fast food, I feel like the customer service has went downhill drastically. And I understand people are doing what they have to do to make ends meet. So they're working jobs they really don't want to be at because they're not getting paid enough. But that doesn't make it okay to be rude to somebody for no reason. And um, I definitely said it loud enough for her to hear me too. So I'm just saying... And that's just in general, period, not even just fast food. Be kind to people. You don't know what people are going through. Like I just said, I've been having a hard time in my life, but I'm not taking it out on the freaking world. It's not, it's not necessary to do that. I was actually being nice by saying thank you because that's just how I was raised. And to, like, you're welcome. It literally would have took two seconds. You didn't even acknowledge me, didn't even look at me or anything. But the world revolves around me, but I'm the person that, like, so anyway, I ended up responding back to the person, but I actually ended up blocking them and deleting the comments. And I think that's what I'm going to continue to do, because like one of my other YouTubers was saying, people um, love when you respond to them, because it's like, oh, I got her to respond to me and, and, and made her get upset and get out of character. So I think I'm just going to continue to do what I've been doing and blocking and deleting. Much, much, much later. Okay, y'all. So I'm just now getting home. It's been a few hours, clearly. Um, so left the eye doctor. They ended up telling me that I have astigmatism and I'm nearsighted. So they gave me some glasses to wear specifically for the nighttime. Let me show y'all. Okay, so this is what they, hold on, man, hold on, hold on. This is what they look like. I like them. Y'all, these are $69. Bitch, what the fuck? What the fuck? I got the cheapest pair because I'm literally only gonna be wearing them at nighttime. They not like everyday glasses, so I really didn't care. They supposed to help with seeing at night um computer screens i really feel like they basically blue light glasses and they sell them at walmart for ten dollars so i basically could have got these for ten dollars 
Leave it alone, please. I think that's all I had to tell y'all. I really don't know what else. Oh, also, I looked and I see that I'm now at 103 subscribers. And y'all don't understand how happy I am about that to be in the triple digits. Like, for some, that may not be a big deal. But for me, it is. So, shout out to everybody. Shout out to all of my new people that have subscribed. Shout out to my old people that still been watching. I'm just so happy about that. It's only, I feel like it's only, you know, up from here. I'm only just going to continue to gain supporters. So I hope y'all have been enjoying my videos. And like I always say, if you have any suggestions of anything I want to see, please let me know in the comments and I will see y'all in the next video. Bye.